video today, man. Yes, Sershki. Title of this video, man, has something to do with the fact why you shouldn't tell everybody in the world what you're doing on social media, man. We're watching a video called When Flexing on IG Goes Horribly Wrong. Now, I'm assuming these people go on live because I don't know why, but people feel like they have to go on live for every and anything, man. If you didn't know, this, dudes will go on live with one viewer and just stay live. And it'd be the most awkward thing ever when you accidentally click the homie live who just be on live by himself. You live with one viewer, man. This is not a live anymore. You're on a FaceTime call. Dudes be going live with each other and don't nobody be joining. But apparently these people went live and things still went wrong. You know how we do it, man. On this channel, if it's drama and it's live, we gonna be there. We gonna be there in an instant, actually. We're, we all for the negativity. We want the worst possible thing to happen. Just keeping it a bean. Just keeping it a bean, 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 bean. If you love negativity, hit the like button. When flexing goes wrong, man. This is why I never been the flexing type of dude anyways. I ain't gonna lie. I used to be in school and I had a homie who used to f who used to flex all of the shoes that he had. I stole his shoe. That's what I would assume happened to people who flex. You probably get robbed. Most people go untouched when flexing their riches online. But here's what happens when flexing of course, online. If you're goes in the Illuminati mansion. Starting with this one girl who was on Facebook Live flexing her stimulus check until someone ran up to the car and snatched all of it from her. And that's why you gotta be what the hell was you even thinking of? I need an explanation to what you were doing on live flexing that little that I ain't gonna act like it wasn't a lot of money She flexing a bankroll. I'm confused, but you're gonna flex the bankroll with your window down How did he even see through your car? Your car got no tent too? You should have used that money to tint your windows. You would have been able to flex in peace This how I know she don't got money. The window's not even tinted you got what you deserve. You gotta be careful when the flex. You didn't even do anything. Where's your reaction you never know time? Who's watching you. And your reaction time was literally on point. She might be a 55 overall. She might be. Why was your reaction? He took your money. You didn't see him walking up nothing. You ain't deserve that stimulus check, man. Next man had to learn this the hard way as well. Because he was vibing in the car, flexing his money, and dancing to some music on live. <laughs> The seconds later, you can see someone walk up on him from the back window. And they start asking the dude where the money is that he was flexing while holding a strap at him. No. Bro, now you fiending. That's when they leave after getting what they want. And the man. Nah, bro. Where the hell was you posted up at? Damn. What this man park his car in the middle of 63rd? This man parked his car in the middle of Chirac? You can't even sit down and listen to music in your car? They fiending that hard? You got snipers on the roof playing peekaboo. How the hell they just catch up with you that fast? This is exactly why flexing is pointless. His goofy self, look at him. He has on. Four, two pairs of glasses. He ain't want no smoke. That's a setup, bro, bro. Bro, that's a setup, bro, bro. That's a setup, bro, bro. That's a setup, bro, bro. I just got robbed, bro, bro. I just got robbed, bro. If I, no, that's a setup, bro, bro. That's a setup, bro, bro. And it might not. Uh, bro, 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 bro. Nobody told you to record every second of your life, bro, bro. Nobody told you to let everybody know what you was doing. What was anybody going to do with this information? And this is why I don't get it. What is, what is somebody supposed to do with you being live with your glasses on flexing money? What are we supposed to do with this information? Yes, you got robbed. You want to rub it in your face? You want to rub it in my face? Okay, I'm going to have that. Thank you. Oh, bro. Yes, you got robbed not have been a setup because you never know who's watching you when streaming on social media but sometimes flexing things other than money can also Yo, be a huge if I mistake gotta look at because this. in this next clip soldier boy wanted to prove to everyone that he was still respected in the streets so he pulled up to the hood on ig live but it ended up going horribly wrong for him and big soldier ain't gonna catch no fame because i'm worth too many m's you dig hey what's going on man hey they say Soulja ain't from the hood. They say Soulja ain't from the hood. Soulja Boy tried putting his arm around the dude, but the other guy obviously wasn't feeling it and told Soulja Boy to get off of him. That's when so Soulja Boy, the corniest rapper. Oh my God, I cringe. Where is he from? He from every single state. 
One time he the first rapper from Cali, Compton. Then he from Atlanta. Then he from Mississippi. What is Soldier Boy? Seeing this man making fun of Metro Boomin's dead mother. After that, I'm like, okay, bruh. I, I rock with 2007 Soldier Boy. I ain't rocked with Soldier Boy in 50 years, bro. How you, how you the rapper trying to be a groupie for another state? How? You trying to be a groupie for another state and you the rapper? They supposed to be groupie for you. I'm around the dude, Negative but the other aura. guy obviously wasn't feeling Negative it. Negative aura. Soldier Boy to get off of him. That's when Soldier put his phone down and acted like he was gonna square up with the guy. No way. No hold on, way. Hold on, hold on, hold on. No way. <laughs> Off, and let's just say this was a very bad look for soldier boy since trying to flex his street credit didn't go as planned and the gang life isn't for everybody because in this next clip a gang member starts snitching to police after getting hum <laughs> humiliated by his ops because the man was talking crazy online until one of his ops caught him slipping in public what? Yeah. yeah you see how easy this is <laughs> Don't say sorry, nigga. You see how easy this? Don't pitch on my soul to be the last time you've been over. Ooh. He, what? I thought y'all was gangsters. Why I'm hearing him say you about to bend over for the last time? Pause. Pause. He talking to you like he your father. Is he okay back there? Is he okay back there? And after his op did that to him, the gangbanger starts crying for help on the live. Since he got done horribly wrong, he even asked for some of his other members to slide for him right now. Oh, help, bro. I need y'all help. I need y'all help. I need y'all help, bro. I need y'all help. I need y'all help, bro. I need y'all help. 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 Bro, I need y'all help. Hey, cut on y'all slide right now, bro. I'm putting on y'all slide right now. Hey. Hey, cuz, I'll fly right now, bro. I'm finna empty the whole clip, bro. I'm oh my god, this is a Call of Duty Black Ops lobby. Oh my god, we chilling in Nuketown. This is a. What the f? I'm finna empty it, bro. Bro, hurry up, bro. I know. He then says he's about to empty the whole clip on the guy since he did that to him. But not seconds after saying that, he starts snitching to the police and tries getting the guy who did him bad arrested. Burn him. He up gun. He up him. He up gun. Hit me all in my face. Okay, okay. Took all my chains and everything. Him. 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 Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Did my guy just snitch before even going into handcuffs but spent five years acting like a gangster? You snitched before the handcuffs was on you? Boy, he took your chains. I would have snitched too. Tell him give me my chain back. I'm confused, bro. Ain't that like negative gangster points? Him, him, him. And speaking of cops, this dude thought it was a good idea to flex his strap and money in public for everyone since he had just gone on a shopping spree. Look at this, man. Monday morning, shopping and oh, look at my oh, oh man, oh man, check it out, check it out. This mother, you see a fire, you can eat that. Hey, hey, but the whole time, now this is where he kind of loses me, bro. That five dollars, <laughs> no, don't you get to throw in that money now. Oh, whoa. Oh boy, I hustle a I hustle a homeless boy for that five dollar dropping on the floor. I don't just sit around and throw money. What's up with that? That's bad luck. That's bad luck. This man don't get money. That's bad luck. You going broke? You gonna need that five dollars one day, and I'm gonna be here having it in my pocket, laughing at y'all. Hey. But the whole time, the man didn't know that the police were sitting back watching him flex with a gun. So he instantly got busted by them a few seconds later. Walk backwards to the satellite boy. Do it now. Put your hands up. Back. 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 You should have known the police was going to watch your black ass. You don't even got your pants on. They halfway down. You got your whole booty cheek cake out, bro. I get it, it's Pride Month, but damn! But damn! You just look like a target. If you walked into my beauty supply store, I'm watching your ass. You gotta get out. Get what you need and go. Then you gonna flex the blick in public? Oh lord, this kid thinks life really is GTA. Uh, what's up? I'm gonna talk to you. 
Gangsters really think they be living in these movies. The next That's dude what it is. asked for his ops to pull up on him. Since he claims he was ready for all the smoke. But when they actually pulled up on him, things went horribly wrong. Because they did him very bad. I want you to pull up. I want you to pull up. Please pull up. Watch your back. What? Seconds later, his ops actually pulled up on him. And that's when things really get crazy because the man starts repping blood. But his ops claim that he isn't a real blood gang member. Nobody's behind me, brother. What's up? <laughs> I thought he didn't know me. Hey, I thought he didn't know me. Oh, oh blood. I ain't never been shit. Nothing. I thought he didn't know me. You not blood. You not blood. Why you ain't just swing on him? Y'all, wait, hold on. I thought y'all was gangsters. Why y'all using phones on phones on phones? He pulled up a blood gang. Then the other dude says, hey, I'm on the live. I'm confused. What you, his girlfriend or what? Get straight to gangster shit. He's in your face saying, show him. Show me. So after doing that, the real blood gang members start going in on the dude who was talking crazy on live. They even go on and take the man's phone and everything. You should have already known, bro. You should have already known he was going to be the one to give you the hands, bro. He said, show me I'm not blood. It's a 5v1 hunt. It's a 5v1 and he talking about, show me I'm not blood. Oh, Lord. He asked to get his ass whooped. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. He hit him with the whammy. That's a whammy. If anybody gets hit with that, they're out for the count. They even go on and take the man's phone and everything. They Eventually, confiscated they your phone like they your parents? <laughs> Hey, pull up. Hey, man, I'm grim. Hey, better quit playing for I burn this, man. Stop playing with me. Quit playing with me for I burn this, man. Quit playing. I'm not quit playing. Speaking of almost getting... Then us as black people be the same people complaining about police violence when we are killing each other in fast rates. This man is talking to this dude like how... How white boys talk in black ops to lobbies. Smoked. This next man was just chilling on the block, smoking until someone ran up to him, robbed him, and popped him. And popped him. Don't reach. Don't reach. Don't reach. Yo, whoa. Lay it Yo. down. Lay it Yo. down. Yo. Let it go. Don't reach. Let's go. And that's why you gotta watch. Your And that's why you gotta watch your surroundings at all times. Because you never know who's plotting on you or out to get you. In this next clip, this man is in the mall flexing some cash in front of this girl. That video was the craziest shit I seen in my life, bro. Y'all, bro, bro, y'all in the hood, man. Y'all some crabs, bro. Bro, the, the hood life is crab in a barrel mentality. Y'all just some crabs. Y'all are literally, oh my God, you just fiending. Now, who is this like? Culture appropriator right here. This is just, this is a terrible fit. Bro has, for one, he has the middle of the mall Cubans on his neck. He definitely got that chain he got on from the middle of the mall. That's a kiosk necklace. Black Air Force Ones, but looks like the friendliest dude at the same time. Bro, how many people know a dude like this, bro? This is a person who says the N-word repeatedly. You don't have to say anything else to me. I can tell. I can tell he just spams the N-word. He thinks he's black! Number, but the whole time, he didn't know that some jack boys were Slim Shady. when he left outside the mall. Boy, if this put all them blues up, I'm gonna stick You better not let me get them at the whip. I'm, I'm telling you. It's gonna be mine. Hey, boy, you better put up. It's gonna be mine. You just don't know Slim Shady. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna get him. Ooh, oh, I'm yeah. Gonna, Where I'm you gonna... parked that? Did you hear that commentary? It sounded like they meet was literally hard, bro. They literally started doing pre-game celebrations before they even came across you because they knew they was about to rob you. You guys are crazy, man. I want to give a shout out to these four people right here, man. Comment what you think about this video in the comment section because I read every single last comment and every single piece of love goes out and is appreciated. And thank you, everybody who watches the videos because you the GOAT. But if you want to shout out like these four people right here, all you have to do is like this video. Let me know that you liked it in the comment section. I go through, I pick four lucky people to get a shout out at the end of every video. Follow my Instagram, join the Discord. Make sure you stay in tune with Duel. Even follow the TikToks, man. You know how we do it. I be going live on YouTube from time to time. Keep the noties on, bro. I don't know when y'all gonna see this, but I'm telling you right now on the third, oops, on the second, I will be live. So yeah, man, I'll see you guys soon, man. It's your boy Dooley.